What, how's the day for golf today? It looks great. I think we're going to get a big play today because the weather's wonderful and nobody got to play golf this weekend and I've already seen a lot of folks I wanted to see. And then uh, what does it mean to uh, come back and see some of your former players, uh, many of them from all the different decades? I feel better already seeing those guys and uh, we're looking forward to coming here and I'm, I'm glad to see these guys come back because it means they care about the program. Well, obviously, you know, the program has uh, always been great. It's, uh, it's continued success is going to continue you know for years and years to come I mean we've got you know great coaches you know the players are getting better better athletes uh, than in our time just kind of weird to say in our times I'm old fogey now uh, but uh, it's just uh, I'm excited where it's going and I'm excited to see what the next four or five years come up I'll bring us up to date what are you doing now and where are you well uh, working for working with the Houston Astros here doing a corporate partnerships uh, you know helping out and contributing with those guys and it's also an exciting time for the Astros you know as we uh, you know, had our first playoff uh, berth in over I mean, 10 years and whatnot. Uh, but it's just a great experience, great time. And, uh, you know, being Houstonian myself, it's uh, like, you know, a dream come true to be able to, to be a part of the Astro organization. Uh, what does it mean to come back and help the program uh, in this tournament? Oh, it means everything. You know, I feel like they put me on the platform where I am today, uh, especially the university and Coach Grimm and all the great staff over here. So, um, you know, i got to give back and, you know, just come out here and enjoy the company and see a lot of old guys we haven't seen in a while. Uh, it's fun to see everybody. Unfortunately, we uh, we probably don't get to talk to each other as much as we used to. We uh, some of us are getting a little bit older than we may like, but um, but it's fun to be out here, see coach, and see some of the current players, and uh, obviously catch up with some of the guys we played with. I was fortunate. I uh, got back up to the big leagues with Baltimore this year, and uh, looks like hopefully I'll be able to go back with them this next year. And uh, and for me at this point, it's just it's just fun to still be playing. I've been very fortunate up to this point, and uh, hopefully get to play for a little bit longer. Uh, we we feel like we're the uh, the, uh, the originals of the group here, so see all the younger guys. We're part of the older group, uh, especially the Wayne group. So uh, it, it's nice, nice to come back, get together, have a good time, play a little golf, raise a little money. I, I look forward to coming back to this every year, um, seeing the guys you played with. And Rice is such a unique place in that uh, we're all a family. So it's great to see the guys that, that played before me, the guys that played after me. Um, it's just, a, a, again, just a, a unique place, and, and I'm very proud to be part of this family. I've always said that is it's, it's the best decision I've ever made is going to Rice, deciding to go to Rice. Uh, it, it definitely uh, made me the person I am. It, uh, yeah. it molded me into into the player that I am, the person, the perspective. Who still needs a little more time? Which player from, say, your era still needs a little more practice, a little more time on the, on the range? My brother. Oh, my God. My brother needs some help. It's like if you're anywhere near him, heads up, because you're in range. To be honest with you, to... Uh say who's the worst golfer out here would be uh, breaking the Rice Owl alumni code. So the fact that my brother would say to me, it's just, you know, hey, we're going to have to settle that in some sort of like domino game at the house at some point because you can't talk bad about one another, especially when it's your own brother. You hear that?